begin with breaking news in Canton. A mother and her baby boy trapped after a violent five vehicle accident on Route 93 South. First responders using the jaws of life to free some of the victims. The highway was shut down in both directions late this morning as a medical helicopter transported the most badly hurt. Let's get right out to News Center 5 Jim Loke for the latest. Jim. Erica, good afternoon. And you can see what's left of the crash scene. It is still a very active scene with police here. But to give you a sense of what exactly happened, let's take you up to Sky 5, which was over the scene. This happened around 11 o'clock today, 93 northbound near exits 2A and 2B over towards Canton and Stoughton. And we're told that there's a sedan involved, and that's where that mother and child, a one year old boy, were in. They were in that vehicle at the time. We are told that that vehicle was rear ended by a van. Effectively pushing those two vehicles into that large truck and another van at the scene. Right now, we know that mother was taken to uh, the Brig Brigham and Women's Hospital. The child was taken to South Shore Hospital with the intent of transferring him to Boston Children's. As for the scene itself, you mentioned, Erica, that the road itself was shut down. Well, now at this point, traffic is moving, two lanes moving through this area once again. That's the good news, but we're still seeing two lanes effectively blocked off altogether. A lot of debris still out here on the road. The jaws of life, as you mentioned, were used and nearby the sunroof. The piece of the sunroof, the entire roof structure was removed and you can see those side curtain airbags nearby. MedFlight was here. They landed on the roadway. They are out of the way now. So once again, traffic is moving. But even on the southbound side, as you move up towards the Dedham area, there's still a lot of delays, a lot of rubbernecking going on as people try to see what's going on at the scene here. But once again, that mother taken to the hospital, the child taken to the hospital, the driver of that truck appears to be okay. No word on the status of the other drivers involved. 